Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the farm. Today, I am canning pork roast. So, I was able to pick up some pork roast from um, Mike Kroger. Excuse me. Goodness gracious, I drank my coffee too fast, I guess. All right, so this is a little over eight pounds, not quite eight and a half pounds. And it was originally $2.49 a pound at $20.69. And I got it for $12.38. So it was $1.49 a pound, which I thought was an excellent price for, po for pork. So I'm going to take this. It's a shoulder picnic. So I'm going to take this. I'm going to cut it up. I'm going to put it in some pint jars and I'm going to get this canned up. I am going to be doing a raw pack on it. Um, I saw, I've seen this several places. Um, I know Sutton Days has done it this way and it seems like one other person, and I can't recall who it was and I apologize, does a raw pack on pork and I looked in my little guide here for my All-American canner, and it does say that you can raw pack, raw pack um, strips, cubes, or chunks of meat, and it tells you how to do it. So, I'm going to be doing pints today. So, I have my pints over here in a hot water bath, getting nice and warm, and ready to go, and I am going to get started on canning up this pork. eight and a half pound roast I was able to get five jars five pint sized jars they're about a pound a piece um and I'm just gonna wipe the rims off with some um vinegar Oh my goodness that roast did have the bone in it so that was a lot of the poundage right there was just um, the bone itself yeah so anyway I am going McDonald's is growling at something. <laughs> I'm going to wipe these rims off and get the lids on. And then get these in the canner. And I'm going to can them for 75 minutes on 10 pounds of pressure because of my um, uh, thousand level. Uh, Basically, I'm in the 10 pound range. That's what, I, that's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, just gonna get these lids on. And to be perfectly honest, I get the appeal of having canned meat on your shelf. I really do get the appeal. Now this is a raw pack, so there's no liquid in here at all. I'm just putting the rings on finger tight. And, but this was a lot of work, and I'm not 100% sure it was worth all this work. Just being honest. I really am just being honest. Okay, so I'm gonna get my, ooh, my lid on. even and everything. 
and get these tightened down. All right, so I'm gonna let that vent, uh, come up to temperature and vent and put my weight on and all that good stuff and process this for 75 minutes. And then I will come back and show you what they, then I will come back and show you what the jars look like when everything is done. All right, here's my pork. It's about 10 o'clock at night, so it has pretty much cooled off. It's pretty much room temperature now, but there it is. All nice and canned up. I will wait until tomorrow, and then I will get these rings off, check the seals, and get these washed, labeled, and put on the shelf. Thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this little video canning some pork. If you did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Click that subscribe button if you haven't already, and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.